So, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Madden 18 video. I tried streaming all the packs that I opened on both accounts earlier today, but I was having severe lag issues. So, I apologize for that uh, if you were unable to see it. But uh, I missed pretty much the entire promo due to the fact of me being out of town this weekend. Uh, I left Friday and didn't get back until early Sunday afternoon. So I pretty much uh, missed everything. AKG was on the account playing Weekend League. And my goodness, did he have a monstrous week. We're going to have some good packs to open for you guys uh, this coming week. Uh, he's going to place top five um, once it's all said and done. He went 24-1, and one, had an absolute hell of a week. And uh, we are going to see if... Uh, if what am I talking about? Not if we're gonna see Mulligan. I'm getting ahead of myself, <laughs> but uh, he was on the account, so I uh, had the points on the account, and I asked him to open up. So he opened up on his stream the uh, legend stuff here. But once I got home, I opened up on my secondary account, and uh, we got some uh, some good stuff. But unfortunately, you were unable to see because of uh, the lag that was happening. But um, there's tons of players that are out. I still haven't gotten everybody, but um, we bought this Bo Jackson for. Uh, 860k yesterday uh when i was streaming well when he was streaming i had asked him hey if you see bo jackson for less than 900k man just scoop him up just go ahead and buy him i'll make the coins back once i uh purchase the bundles and start moving all the pieces and stuff so uh we purchased this bow yesterday for like 860 and uh, he looks absolutely incredible he looks like barry sanders with jerome bettis style trucking you take a look his agility acceleration all that stuff is slightly less um but uh, he does have the equal speed. Now, Barry Sanders is plus one speed faster. But uh, because of the John Madden coach, you know, Barry Sanders is still going to be plus one speed faster. But Bo Jackson is 95 speed. Uh, you take a look. Juking is equal at 96. His trucking is 96. So that right there is what makes this card monstrous. Now, I believe you can have Bo Jackson at literally every offensive position. <coughs> From left guard to tight end to center, it's crazy. Uh, and they're all 95 overalls, too. Uh, but we decided to just go with the old-fashioned running back bow. Uh, again, Barry Sanders with bow, uh, not, not with, with uh, Jerome Bettis-style trucking, meaning he's going to run through you, by you, around you, and he's just going to be insane. And he also has battle ready. How glitchy is that? Now, you never realize how glitchy Never Stumble is until you get a card with it, and then you realize, like, yo, it's pretty damn good. But Battle Ready is so, so, so good to where you're going to be spamming the A button and winning those tackle battles uh, damn near every time. Uh, but again, if there's a one-on-one -on -one situation, you can choose to either truck or juke. If you know if somebody has a night train lane and you're going towards him, you know he has secure tackler, you know you cannot truck him, then you can juke him. If you go and you run and you see that they have a Ken Houston or they have a Mike Adams or they have somebody unfakeable, you know you can truck them. So he is just an absolute monster. Uh, and I, I haven't played with him yet, uh, but I will get some gameplay a little later on today to upload for you guys tomorrow. But I've seen AKG play with him, and he was having a ball. He, oh my goodness, he was just running a muck, trucking everybody, running by them, running through them. It, he just looks absolutely monstrous. We also picked up this Marvin Harrison. Now, it's been a while since I picked up a new receiver. I think the last new receiver I picked up was uh, Randy Moss. Uh, well, well, I mean, Devin Hester and uh, Irvin, too. But, I mean, like, a real, like, you know, promo guy that came out. I picked up... Uh, Irvin like two weeks after he came out just because I did the Dallas camp and I got Hester because he's so damn fast he's the fastest card in the game I believe uh, might not be now with all the new cards I don't even know all the cards that came out but um, this Marvin Harrison just looked way too good not to get you take a look and uh, we compare him to uh, <coughs> Odell who has been my number two receiver since Moss came out and Marvin Harrison is faster higher catching more elusiveness uh, similar spec catch, more release, far more route running, better catching traffic, just slightly less jumping. So this car just looks like he is going to run his routes so crisp. 97 route running means anything with an angle, any out route, any post, any C routes, any in route, anything that's not a streak. This man should be able to create some pretty good separation out there. And I've seen this card and I was like, good lord. I got to have him. 
got to have him on the squad. So we went ahead and did him. And it actually was pretty easy to do, excuse me, as I take a sip of my son's Kool-Aid. Don't tell him I took one of his pouches. It's Capri Sun Roaring Waters Tropical Fruits. Really good. Um, I actually pulled the 92 overall card, the highest card that went into the set. I pulled on my other account, so I traded that card over to do the set over here. So that saved me. That 92 overall card is going for like nine, like 500K. So I was able to do this card, and I also pulled the 92 overall Bruce Smith card. I pulled that one too, and um, I was able to do both of their sets for less than like 500K. I was able to do both of them for like less than 500K, which is a pretty good deal if you ask me. Um, again, this Marvin Harrison looks insane. Um, I would like a new quarterback because Michael Vick I play very stupidly with, <laughs> but he's so much fun. Um, again, can't wait to play with Bo. I already know that, um, you know, I usually went with Earl Campbell, who I, who's actually on the auction block. Now, I actually did the set to upgrade to 95, um, LaDainian Tomlinson as well. He's, he's a 96 right now. <coughs> I, um... Used to go with Earl Campbell, like if I wanted to run a dive or if I wanted to run, wanted to run wham, you know, like I don't like Barry Sanders going up through the, the gaps. You know, he's definitely a runner you want on the outside uh, because going through traffic, running straight through the middle of the field, is very difficult to get some jukes off of because it's so, it's so congested. But with Bo, it doesn't matter. I can stretch, I can wham, I can toss, I can dive, I can draw. It doesn't matter. He can handle any type of congestion. It is a sign of field. I'm able to run around, through, in, out. Like this card is going to be so much fun. Definitely looking forward to uh, you know being able to play with him. And then defensively, everything is the same. And if you take a look, if anybody's wondering why the coins we went down like five, six mil, we were doing tons of giveaways on AKG stream. <coughs> Um, I let him give away, I think, three mil yesterday, another five mil. Um, he only gave away half, so, um, you know, got to support. He's doing a big favor for me, hopping on, playing the weekend league. I definitely enjoy watching the, the like the team that I have. I enjoy watching, you know, I like watching Lawrence Taylor and Aaron Donald and and uh, all these monsters play, especially when you have a really good player like um akg running because I, I could never be as good as he is he's so damn good at the game and it's almost unfair him having this team you know playing people like he's i think he only lost like three times he's like a hundred and like three with this team it's insane on how good he is and um you know to give back because he's on the account playing you know we help each other you know he's helping me get great rewards that i can make a video out of and it helps him when he's streaming because people are going to want to see the crazy team and you know the new legend so they come to his stream because they know he's going to be playing with them and to, to you know help him out it's like you know if we get 10 new subscribers then you can give away five mil worth of cards six mil worth of cards so that's why the coins are low uh well not low let me not say that was a dirt bag that's why they're lower if anybody's just wondering like you got two cards. Where did seven mil go? Because, you know, we've been doing... I, there's going to be more giving away um, to uh, AKG's, uh, you know, stream. Got to support who supports you. Um, we picked up <coughs> this Bruce Smith today. And, again, we pulled this 92 overall card. And I think, like, back-to-back -back packs, I pulled Marvin Harrison and Bruce Smith's uh, 92 overall card. So that right there was awesome to know that uh, his set was going to be relatively cheap for me to do. And the reason why we went with him over uh beasley was because of the speed isn't too far off right 84 speed 85 with the john madden coach it's not that far off of 88 yeah i would prefer 88 speed don't get me wrong but 85 is still pretty fast but then when you take a look when he had 95 power move and 93 finesse move i don't know about you guys but that's pretty insane like that makes me want to do the the buffalo chem to uh, do the elite um, chemistry tiered up for the uniforms and the um, the coach. Well, I can't do the coach because I got Coach Madden. For the both uniforms at the stadium. Because then I'll be able to give him plus one power and finesse move the same way how I'm able to do that with um, Two Tall Jones here. Two Tall Jones, because of the Dallas chemistry, is able to get... Um, you can see right here, we're up to tier nine. He gets plus one, juking, release, press. That doesn't actually show everything he gets. He gets more than that. But um, I, I think uh, I'm able to get one 
finesse move and power move there as well. Maybe even a block shed too. I'm not really sure. But uh, still, 93 power, 93 finesse. 95 power, 93 finesse is just makes him damn near unblockable, right? And then you add in 94 strength, which is really, really high. And then he has 89 block shed, you know, uh, standard. But then we're adding plus two from the physical front that's completely tiered out. And then we're adding another plus two from Von Miller, who we actually went ahead and tiered up. Uh, the day it came out Friday, I put him in the set, made sure I tiered him up. So every Von Miller that comes out, I'm able to have plus two block shed to the squad. And I think that's really the awesome decision from them to be able to make that a uh, power upable. So uh, we're adding plus four block shed. So we go from 89 all the way to 93. And this card, along with two tall Jones, looks absolutely devastating to have on the edges. I mean, you take a look at Two Tall Jones here, and he has 98 block shed with 94 power move. Insane. And then you go on the other side, and with Bruce Smith, we have 93 block shed, 95 power move, 93 finesse move, great strength. Just absolutely insane, man. Both of these cars looking really, really, really good, and I cannot wait to uh, see what they can do. Hold on, let me see. So, physical front adds plus two block shed. Von Miller adds plus two, so that's four. So then, yeah, so that means two tall Jones, that plus one block shed is from the Dallas camp. So I could actually add another block shed if I decide to do the training camp for the Bills. I can add another block shed and make that 94. And then I could have him with 96 and 94 finesse move, which would be pretty glitchy. But for now, I only I think he's my only Bill player. So he would be the only one benefiting from that. So um, the Cowboys, I had two tall and, and I had... Um, uh, Michael Irvin, but you know, I, I uh, put him as our uh, number fifth receiver because OBJ and, and Harrison are just faster. Um, plus, I expect the Dion to be coming out soon, so uh, but yeah, that's the team, guys. I will have gameplay coming out tomorrow, and uh, I have been working on my um, Coach Madden set. I've been doing squads every morning, well, not the past three days because I was away, but. Um, still, I've been doing um, collectibles. No, I want the coaches. Collectibles. We'll go to, I think there's gold. I think I got a few gold. Um, well, those are the presents I opened up. Where's the... Uh... Oh, they're in the set. That's why. They're in the Madden set. <coughs> I was able to do a few. I need to do a lot, lot more in order to, uh, it, um, to do the sets probably gonna take me a month and a half but i'll get it done eventually you see here we have four out of ten and you need three elite so right here's another 10 20 30 40 50 i need 60 silver tokens in order to finish this and that would be one elite badge and i would need two more i got such a long way to go but i'm working on it you know little by little you know every morning you know i just finished a uh a season won my Super Bowl in squads not too long ago. I think I like Wednesday, and then like the next day, I was able to uh, play a handful of games, uh, which I've been streaming every morning. First thing in the morning, I'll stream my squad games, and uh, you can see we're four and one, getting closer to another playoff run. So as long as we keep winning, getting these squad tokens, eventually I'll chip away and be able to get those. So, and uh, you can see my binder is uh, once I did Coach Madden, I went all the way down to like 700 items. Now I'm back all the way up to like 1300 because we pulled a ton of those promo packs. And I got I to gotta sell a lot. I have uh, 114 out of position players. So uh, we have quite a bit to go through and uh, put on the auction block and sell. Little by little, we'll go on. And do I already got the Bo Jackson, so I'm not looking to do any sets. I'm not interested in any other player that's out right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and just put all these on the auction block and sell these, make as much coins as possible. So... That's the plans for that. And also my second account, which I have a ton of uh, out-of-position players and whatnot, too. So, uh, anyways, man, hopefully you guys enjoy. It's your boy GS, man. Again, gameplay will be coming tomorrow. And uh, look forward to uh, hopefully putting in some work with Bo. Peace.